Hi, this is Gina Versa from the Waffle Press Movie Podcast. I just saw an early screening of Thoroughbreds um, earlier this week. It is a well-written, tense thriller and also a dark comedy. It's um, quite unexpected in the twists and turns it goes into, but first it was directed by playwright Corey Finley, who does a great job of writing these characters and giving them depth, three dimensions. Um, It's an exploration of a lot of teenage angst, but it doesn't quite feel as cliche as most uh, teenage films do, which is appreciated. Um, It really defies expectations. Um, And Anya, Taylor-Joy, and Olivia Cooke completely carry this film. Uh, their characters are really offbeat and great. They play them with such life and nuance that they feel like real people. Um, and, you know, Anya is great in everything she does. And, you know, Olivia Cook, I'm a big fan of, so it was cool to see these two together on the big screen. And speaking of performances, um, there's an excellent final performance by Anton Yelchin. It's bittersweet to see him in this film. He's great in it, by the way, but it's just sad knowing after this you'll never see him in anything again. And he plays such a greasy con man, and he really inhibits this role and brings a lot of himself, you know, not himself, but the crazy actor that he was. And it's just cool to see him one last time. Um, but, you know what could have been, what in films he could have been, just kind of goes in the back of your head. Uh, Corey Finley at the screen had a lot of cool stories about Anton Yelchin. Apparently he drove crew members back to their homes in the rap party, so that was cool hearing that. And, you know, the, just back to Thoroughbreds, it's unconventional. I would say horror film because it deals with a lot of horror elements, a lot of murder, blood, gut, stuff like that, and ultimately it brings a lot of life into sort of this teenage angst drama. Um, I would really recommend it to people to see, um, you know, give money to independent films, you know, give this film a chance, it might surprise you. Um, it comes out this Friday, it, it, um, is, you know, just a great film. So March 9th, if you want to see it, just check it out at your local uh, theater. Thanks, this has been Gina Versa. I've been professionally unprofessional. <laughs>